comic book readers, this is Danny Danger, and I'm bringing you coverage of the Staple Independent Media Expo. Staple is a con for people who like to support independently published comics and creator-owned work. What does creator-owned mean, though? It means that the creator or creators own the rights to the material, even if it's published by a large publisher. Why are indie comics so great? We talked to a few Staple exhibitors to find out. What do you love the most about creating your own comics? Well, with creator-owned comics, you can do whatever you want. I mean, that really is the best reason in the world. I get to say and do whatever I want to, which is awesome, because I can make commentary on stuff that if I was drawing for somebody else, they wouldn't let me. What I like most about creating my own comics is the absolute freedom I have in the, uh, the content of the comic itself. The big mainstream stuff is great, but it's those little, those little nuggets, those little things that remind you why you love comics and why comics are important is found in the creator-owned stuff. You know, I'm able to get away from the sort of superhero ghetto a little bit and explore and really, you know, for, for a medium that's just a combination of words and pictures, we haven't really done much with it. So I think creator-owned is, you know, the, your best opportunity to just have those other genres that we desperately need. Why is it important for readers to go out of their way to support and buy the indie comics that they like and read? Well, it's very simple. I mean, you either can eat McDonald's for the rest of your life, or you can try other restaurants. I need tacos. <laughs> That's where the raw, unbridled talent comes from. That's where you're more likely going to find things that challenge the medium, that challenge the challenge the way stories are told. That's where you'll find deconstructions of things. Like, I'm making these, own, these comics out of my own pocket, you know, printing them all and what have you. And uh, I need the support of uh, the community around me and such to keep producing my own comics. We don't really make money off of this. Most of us work really, really bad jobs because we do what we love for a living. And it takes more money to do what we love than we actually earn. <laughs> so it's the same thing with music. You know, you've got to support the creators and the musicians you love or you're going to get Disney radio for the rest of your life. So it's really important, especially now where we are having corporations just devouring, you know, Disney owns everything and what Disney doesn't own, Warner Brothers owns the rest of it. And then there's all the, everybody in this room, you know, are indie creators, so we need the fans to support us. I mean, it's the only way we can last. Please read our comics. Which independent art and creators are you supporting? Be sure to subscribe to our channel so you can see more guides for newbies to comic books. You can check out our poll list. You can check out more staple coverage. And be sure to tell me down below in the comments what I should be reading. Who are indie comic book creators that you support?